I want to thank everyone for, for coming out. Uh, particularly, a uh, huge thanks to Symantec, who's been sponsored us uh, since uh, we started this program two years ago, and all the others, NASDAQmail.com. We'd also like to thank the IRL, uh, particularly for all the work they've done with the unification. Uh, it's been not only great for our sponsors, but uh, huge for the fans. Uh, we're really pleased to announce today that the Luso Dragon Racing team is going to participate in the, com in the full 2009 season. We've been focusing the last two years on the cars, learning more about the tracks, and really focused on getting the right people. After really uh, a very difficult 2008, we're looking forward to 2009. We've got a great young driver in Rafael Matos. We think this guy has the, the heart of a champion. Nine out of the last 11 seasons, he's won the championship in the series which he's competed in. And, uh, you know, he's focused on, on winning here at uh, Lusso Dragon Racing. Yeah, it means a lot for me. It means pretty much everything I try to to achieve in the United States, uh, my, my career here, it's an uh, it's unbelievable feeling. I uh, can't really describe. I think it's, uh, this team has a lot of talents and a lot of good people, and uh, I think that's how we're going to make the difference. Uh, I think we have, uh, we're capable of uh, uh, getting good, great results, uh, uh, possible winning races as well for next year. And, I'm just looking forward on, 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 on the program. You know, I have to thank Steve and Jay for giving me such a great opportunity and everyone that has been supporting this team. It's just a, a great opportunity. I, I think it prepares really well. Um, the car is uh, it's similar to IndyCar. Um, obviously, you're running the same tracks and, and also the dynamics of the weekend, it's, it's, it's very similar as far as qualifying and, and the, the practice sessions and the race. So it, I think it's a, it's a great series to prepare you to, to, to IndyCar. Um, well, obviously, I, I still learning, especially on ovals. Uh, you don't learn everything in seven or eight races uh, in Indy Light. So now I'm going to take another step uh, in, in my learning curve in the ovals. Uh, it's been a pretty steep learning curve, and I'm just uh, looking forward working with, uh, with all the engineers trying to you know, get all the information I can from out of them. And obviously last year I had a chance to test the IndyCar for three days in the oval and, and one day in the road course. So I, I have a little bit of advantage there.